Hey guys, check it out. New tone test day. So what are we working on today? Well, what I wanted to do is I've got my Mark 535 over here on top of the vertical 212 cabinet with my ESP Kamikaze 1. And I've also got this Bose PA with mixing board. What I wanted to do is I wanted to show the difference between when we're running straight out of these guys versus when we're running the XLR out on the back of this Mark 535, just like the 25 and the JP2C have, where you can run direct into the soundboard, um, either keeping that as a monitor or just turning that off. You don't even have to show up with a speaker. You can just show up with this head, plug it right into the mains. So a lot of guys say that the cab clone doesn't sound very good. And to be honest, yeah, okay, it's not the best version of that thing on the market. However, the fact that it's built into this amp is eminently useful. So I still wanted to show that. Now, what I'm going to do today is I'm, I've got a tone dialed in here, and I'm just going to go straight out into the board with everything neutral, tone, unity, uh, just so that you can hear what it's going to come through straight as is. But keep in mind, I think one of the reasons guys are complaining is because they're just plugging straight in and expecting their normal settings here to sound good here. Realistically, it does sound a little different. And if you, you know, turn your knobs, you can probably get a pretty darn good tone coming out of the PA. Um, anyway, wanted to show that and excited. Don't know if anybody else has really done something of that nature. So I'm just gonna play a riff. I'll start out just on this, then I'll hop over to this and on here, you'll see me reach back behind and I'll flip through the three different modes and I'll put the timestamps in the video so you can see which one is which. So check it out, have a listen and let me know what you think. All right guys, bye.